This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Oh, what's up people? Dobbs with Wolves is right here and welcome to another Pokemon pack opening and today I am excited for this. Check out GeekRetreat.com, they are amazing as always. And today I am praying to the gods themselves, the power of Modoho, the power of Arceus. We open up the pre-release build, ba build to battle, build and battle, brilliant star box. <sighs> I am excited for this people. Why? Because this set contains around about, I think it's five or six Charizards in this set. This is one of the biggest sets ever to have that many Charizards. But there is a downfall. I bet you money that some of them Charizards will drop in value like crazy. Probably not the not probably not the Rainbow Rare, or the Full Art, or the Alternate Artwork, but all the rest of the other Charizards, like the Standard Vs, probably not worth a lot. But I'm excited as always. I like opening up and hunting down my Charizards as always. We got ourselves a pre-release box. Let's see what our pre-release card could potentially be. But like I said, that's who we're after. We're after Charizard, but also I would love to get Arceus or Shaman. I'd love to get Shaman as well. So let's have a looky. So we got ourselves, of course, our little checklist and everything. There's about 172 um, cards in this set, but there is other secrets in this set as well. I think the other secrets as well are like cameo Pokemon tra trainers, so that's cool. So we got ourselves Charizard, a Charizard, Shaman and a Charizard. Oh, this is a lucky one. And we get ourselves, I think, one of the worst pre-release hollows, um, um, Bebabble. Now I know that if Bebabble is the most famous card because of, because of all its memes and all that lot, but I think for Pokemon card reasons, I think it is the worst pre-release card that in this set. But either way, it's awesome to have it. It's definitely going to be in my collection. Let's open this up first-handed. Let's have a look at him. Let's see what his condition is as well. I hate these cellophane packs. They drive me insane. There we go. Lovely jubbly. So let's have a looky. So he's not pretty bad to be honest. Don't see any whiting a little bit. Probably a little tiny dink up there but it's alright. I'm happy with it. It's a cool pre-release card. I'll take it any day. And here's the normal cards that you get as well. I love the effect of the energy cards now, so that's really nice. A lot of fire energies because you probably, this is all about a fire and leaf uh, set. Professor's Research, Magma Bassin, Focus is really good as well. Gloria as well. I keep forgetting that Gloria is the main antagonist in um, Sword and Shield. Cynthia's, Barry, Bidoof, Bibarel, Tortrig. Nice, Torterra's, Moltres, nice, Chimchar, and of course, oh, yep, Infernape. So pretty much this set of uh, Brilliant Star, by the look of the cards, this is mainly dedicated to the very end of Sword and Shield, but the start of uh, Pokemon Diamond and Pearl, you know, Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, um, but as well as probably the very, very slight beginning of Legends Arceus, so yeah, so pretty much three games in one set. Very exciting. I'm hoping we get something to get out of four packs. Let's see what we can get. <sighs> Let's do it. So here you go. Here's your code for the very first pack of Brilliant Star. Let's see what we can get. Lovely psychic energy right there. We've got Cynthia's Ambition. We've got Karen's Care. Pachirisu. Beautiful card. Bidoof. Electabuzz, Haluchador, we got Bereasel, Gibble, a Reverse Foil, a Siliga, and a Magmortar, a nice little cameo there with Electivire right there, that's nice indeed, but no Hollow yet, perfectly fine, it was the first pack, Calm Before the Storm. Now just to let you guys know, I haven't just opened, op you know, bought just random packs for this set. I've actually gone ahead and bought myself a booster box of this, which will get opened probably next month. Not this month, so get you, just to get your uh, palette wetted 
for this set because this set is going to be amazing for myself, I think. We've got a Lictabuzz, a Bidoof, and a Wormadam. Mmm, okay. Next pack. We can't have another special build a deck box pre release set that gives us nothing. We need a hollow. Give us a V card, anything would be nice. Bassin, a uh, Quadrant, a Ultra Ball, Sock, Cherubi, which I'm still looking for in Legends Arcus. This thing's driving me insane. Riolu, Starly, Spiritomb, a Reverse World Bernie. Oh, nice! We got ourselves an Agron V. I'll take that. One of the coolest monsters, coolest Pokemon in um, Ruby and Sapphire. Beautiful card. That's actually a really cool Agron card, to be honest. Nice, we've got ourselves a V card out of four packs at the moment, so that's good, to be honest. I can actually walk away happy now, because we've got ourselves an actual good card. So, if this has nothing in it, I do not mind. But like I said, it's not over yet, because we are opening up a bit more Brilliant Star to death this month. So, keep yourself ready for that. Clefairy, Cherubi, Sock. Team Yell's Cheer and a Leopard. Mmm, never mind. So, before we do say, say goodbye, people, as always, let's see what we pulled for reverse foils out of Bower Packs. We got ourselves Team Yell's Cheer, which is an uncommon. Burmy, Bidoof, and a Siligeth. And then for our Hollows of the Day, of course, we got ourselves the best card in the set, I'm sure. <laughs> B Barrel, pre release card but also Agron V. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button as always. And like I said, please check out geekwithstreak.com. They are amazing every single day. They help me out finding the products. And like I said, the best community all over Manchester. With that being said, the people I'm going to you guys subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! No Charizard yet. But like I said, there's about five of them in this set. It can be possible to get at least one of them. Let's hope for that. I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Oh! Oh!